Red Pill update really quick. Vladimir Putin, one of the most powerful men in the world, is invoking the name of Gonzalo Lira. There's a Russia Today article about it now where he says the Kiev regime tortured U.S. journalists to death and nobody's asking why. Somehow the ghost of Coach, the memory, the legacy of Coach, it lives on as his name is spoken by Vladimir Putin. What a fucking timeline to be in. R.I.P. Coach. Oh, R.I.P. Well, oh, sevens for gone. Oh, sevens. Yeah. Ultimate, like, it's just crazy to think about it because the guy was like the ultimate scam artist, flim flam man. He pretended that he was like he was like a dating coach. He was an economist. He was a writer. He just had, he was like the man of every unlimited talent. And it was just amazing watching him grift his way through life. But it all came to an end when he took on the, the, the grift of being a super secret agent of Vladimir Putin. When he took on the role of being a dissident in a war zone, it didn't really work <laughs> for Coach. <laughs> but he went down in the most keno way possible on his fucking motorcycle trying to gun it to the border. We'll never forget Coach's service to the art of Kino. He was a showman to the bitter fucking end. Instead of actually escaping the country and living on, Coach decided it was better to go live on YouTube and alert the Russian authorities to his position near the Hungarian border so that he could deliver his showmanship one final time. Wait. God bless Gonzalo. As <laughs> Sober Sheldon says here... PvP, I thought you were making that up. No, he was not making that up. Making that is what the, up? The, the all that shit. No, that was all real. No, that that's was, all real. So he was though. No, somebody said Ukraine. Yeah, he was in Ukraine, but he was trying to get to the Hungarian border to get uh, what's it called asylum. But he told the authorities where he was going. So it was yeah, not wise. and we covered it on. Uh, on our first studio there. By the way, you know what's funny about, about this photo of me, him, and Nick, right? Someone goes, if you told me that, that uh, if I were to guess who would be on drug, arrested for drugs and yeah. dead, I would be wrong about yeah. this photo in 2024. You, you would really <laughs> think that Andy would have been the one that would either be arrested for drugs or dead. Somehow, Gonzo's dead and Riccada's arrested for drugs. What a wild, wild